Hello everybody, I am B. Mitch, and this list is kind of a special list because I wasn't really planning on doing this one. It started off as a top 10 matches I'd watch because I haven't really watched wrestling in a very long time. There isn't really that much about wrestling that I like now, so I haven't really sat down and watched a pay-per-view or something like that in a very long time. However, when I tried to put together a top 10 list of matches I'd watch, I couldn't even come up with three. I mean, let's face it, with the exception of AJ Styles, Roman Reigns, and guys like that, the company really doesn't put a lot of stock into anybody who's not a part-timer. So, or John Cena, or Randy Orton, somebody who's been there for a long time. So... Um, instead, this list, it, um, it is the top five Brock Lesnar matches I'd watch. These are all guys that Brock Lesnar has never had a fight against before that I think would be at least fun to watch. Uh, so, and, and also there are two other matches at the end that don't have Brock Lesnar in it that I was able to to come up with. I probably won't give like any um, um, uh, reasons for those matches if I even talk about them at all though. So with that being said, top five Brock Lesnar matches I'd watch. Starting off with number five. This is Bray Wyatt versus Brock Lesnar and I'm going to be completely honest, the only reason why this matchup is on here is because I needed at least five matches and Bray Wyatt, the company hasn't really gotten behind him really. At WrestleMania, he's lost every single match he's been in, even if it makes sense for Bray to go over. He's lost to Cena, he's lost to Undertaker. Even though Undertaker had already lost this the streak by that point, so why not put Bray over? And just at this past Mania, he lost to Orton. So Bray Wyatt really hasn't been built up very well at all. And if Bray did fight Brock Lesnar, I'm like 99% sure that Brock Lesnar would win. But I did need a number 5 matchup. And Bray Wyatt is better built up than anybody else I could think of for the number five spot. So Bray Wyatt versus Brock at least would be somewhat of a good matchup if booked right. But I think that Brock Lesnar would definitely win. The next matchup is Brock Lesnar versus Chris Jericho. And for this one, I think that the peak of when this matchup would have been at its best was back during a ruthless um, aggression era when Brock and Jericho were both younger but Brock and Jericho they can still work um, in the ring so I think that it it could still be a good matchup uh, it just depends on how they book it but I think that Chris Jericho he, he doesn't often win matches He's mostly just there to put people over, so I think that in this case, even though it would be a good match still, uh, Brock Lesnar would definitely beat Jericho, I think. And this next matchup, I picked it because it'd be more of a power versus power, big guy versus big guy kind of thing. It's Sheamus versus Brock Lesnar, and this one... Uh, Sheamus is a former world champion, so it does make sense for him to be, um, uh, like have a fight with Brock Lesnar somewhere down the line. And even though uh, it would be a good matchup, I think, I would not be surprised if Brock Lesnar won this one also. Even though, due to Sheamus' style of wrestling, he probably could at least have a good matchup with, with uh, Brock Lesnar. For this one, it is Samoa Joe versus Brock Lesnar. And for this one, I've watched Samoa Joe in TNA. Some of his ROH matches, but not that much in ROH. But Samoa Joe, I think that he's a good wrestler. I think that this would be very good to see. 
I think that Samoa Joe would definitely put on a good matchup with Brock, kind of like CM Punk. Even though Punk and Joe, uh, Samoa Joe is is um, stronger than CM Punk, so it could be more like power versus power as opposed to speed versus power. But I think that uh, Samoa Joe, oh, he would have a good matchup with, with Lesnar. If he did win, I wouldn't be surprised, but Samoa Joe just got in the company not too long ago. Well not just got in the company I should say just got on the main roster not too long ago so they would have to build him up to the point where he could fight Lesnar but this would be very good uh, I think for this last matchup and the mat and the Brock Lesnar match I'd be most um excited to see it's AJ Styles versus Brock Lesnar this matchup could be kind of like uh, CM Punk versus Brock Lesnar in the sense that it's power versus speed with you know AJ Styles being very fast and uh, Brock Lesnar being the big strong guy I've watched AJ Styles for a while in TNA um, you know uh, um, when he was in TNA not so much in ROH because right up around that time I was just almost done with wrestling as a whole so I haven't watched that uh, that many of his matches since he left TNA but I think that Brock Lesnar versus AJ Styles it would be a good matchup in my opinion I wouldn't be too surprised if um, well if, if Styles won because he has gotten a, a strong push but I think that this matchup would be very good to see like somewhere down the line at maybe like a summer slam or something and I think that it would be the Brock Lesnar matchup I would uh, like to see the most